Namaste beautiful yogis, welcome to an espresso short class. Let's begin. Standing at the front of the mat. No surprises, we're starting standing. Getting ready to align the energies of the body with the breath, visualizing crown of the head reaching high, the roots reaching deep. Staying grounded, reaching up, expanding, opening through the heart center, opening up the field a little bit around us, opening up the aura a little more. Inhale your arms all the way over the head, lift and reach. Take a breath in here, exhale here. One more time, inhale here. Clasp the hands, exhale over to your left. Inhale up. Exhale to your right. Inhale up. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And coming back up, reaching over the head. Hands behind the head. Press the elbows back and open as if you're trying to re reach the ceiling, protect the ceiling with your heart. Back to center, inhale over the head, exhale, diving. Inhale, look ahead of you, exhale, folding. Inhale, look ahead of you, exhale, folding. Inhale, look ahead of you, bring the hands on the floor, step it back. Plank. Shift your plank forward, shoulders over the fingertips. Shift your plank back, shoulders over the wrists. One more time, shift forward, shift back. If you have any pain in your wrists, keep the shifting part because you should focus for now on spreading the weight equally onto the palms of the hands. And if you're dealing with any wrist pain, visualize a spiral movement up into the forearm. So some of the weight is going into the forearm. Lower down Chaturanga. Upward facing dog. Chaturanga. Downward facing dog. Come into plank and lower down onto forearm plank. Shift forward, chin over the thumbs, shift back, shoulders over the elbows, shifting forward, shifting back. One more time, shifting forward, shift back, bring the left forearm across align it with the top of the mat take side plank forearm side plank signature interval yoga move knee to elbow one knee to elbow two three four five six seven eight nine ten Grab your knee and squeeze it into your rib cage. Hold. Forearm plank. Shift forward. Shift back. St 
strong shift forward back last one back opposite forearm plank hand behind head knee to elbow one two three four five six seven eight nine then squeeze your knee into your rib cage. Let it go. Forearm. Changing forearm sides again. We're going strong already. Left knee, right elbow. Ah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Squeeze your knee into your rib cage. Hold. Let it go. Plank. Shift forward and back. Forearm plank. Shift forward and back. Shift forward. Back. Side plank on the opposite side. Right knee to left elbow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and squeeze your knee into a rib cage. Excellent. All the way into plank or forearm plank and now plank. Take the right leg up, bring your knee between your elbows and drop it just half an inch over the mat. So the shin bone is hovering over the mat and back plank. Opposite side, left leg comes up knee between the elbows and lower down hovering as if you're about to rest there but you're not allowing it and let it go press back in down dog inhale the right leg up Step it between your hands. Press the back heel back. Come up. Left hand onto the right knee, twist here. We're detoxing today. Facing up. Clasp the hands and reach over to your right. Sink a little deeper in your lunge. And coming back to center. Hands on the hips. We're going to pulse the back leg, back leg 10 times. So take a steady stance on the right side and reach with the left one, two, tapping it off the floor, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, reaching over the head, exhale down, plank, chaturanga, up dog, Chaturanga, downward facing dog. Inhale the lift, step it through. Come up, high lunge. And let's bring the right hand onto the left knee, twist you.
reaching over the head clasping the hands and let's reach over to the left lengthening both sides of your torso sink a little deeper coming back up hands onto the hips then we're tapping the right foot off the floor 10 times squeezing the booty engaging the left leg one two three four five six seven eight nine ten good reach over the head exhale down plank Chaturanga, up dog. Chaturanga, down dog. Inhale the right leg up, step it through, high lunge, hands in prayer twist, drop the back knee down and work your chest, uh, the mid middle of your chest towards your prayer hands. Exhaling and twisting into it, softening into it, and coming up. Exhale the hands on the floor and glide your right foot towards your left. Walk your hands on the outside of your mat to your right and just hold this twist here. And come back up. Step it back. Chaturanga. Up dog. Chaturanga. Down dog. Take the left leg up, step it through, high lunge. Hands in prayer, twist. Exhale into your twist. Keep breathing here and keep the intention of softening with each exhalation. Drop the back knee down and work that twist. Coming back up. Exhale down. Glide your left foot back and out to your right. And now walk your hands to your left. twist and a hip opener softly coming back step it back take the right foot to the center of your mat step it on the outer edge of the left of the left side of your mat and bring the knee down towards the mat so another twist good and change sides left foot steps in out and knee lowers down. Plank, chaturanga, up dog, chaturanga down dog.
Inhale the right leg up, step it through. High lunge. Open the arms out, twist to your right. Walk the right hand down the left leg and reach here. Softening the right shoulder. Great, as you come out of this, you're just going to bring the outer edge of your shoulder or the shoulder on the outside of your right knee. Left shoulder, right knee. And keep twisting here. Drop the back knee down, slide it, glide the foot back, and hold here. A twist. Soft. Walk your hands to the front, hold here, and step back. Plank, Chaturanga, Up Dog, Chaturanga, Downward Facing Dog. Take the left leg up, step it through, high lunge, open the arms out and twist to your left, drop the left hand down, reach through your right hand, soften. Let's bring the right hand on the outside of the left knee. Drop the back knee and you can glide the foot here. Facing forward, holding in this hip opener and splits prep and step it back plank. Let's lower the left forearm on the ground, forearm side plank. We're going to bring the knee into the rib cage, and then we're going to grab the foot and open it forward. One, two, three. Four, five, and change sides. Knee in, toe hold open. One, two, three. Change signs one more time. Here you're going to take the left knee into your right hand, hold and maybe open slightly up. One, two, twisting the or bringing the knee across. Three, four, kind of like a twist here. Five, changing sides. Twist it up. Two, three, four, and five. Two, forearm plank. Let's come into down dog.
Inhale the right leg up, step it through. Drop the back heel down, warrior one. Sink a little deeper here. And let's straighten both legs. Square the hips, lower the left hand down, try and pose. Facing down, chest over the leg. Walk both hands onto your right and take a side crow as a twist here. And back. So here you're going to take your intense side stretch foot alignment again and slightly walk your hands to your right for extra stretch. Excellent, step it back, plank. Chaturanga. Up dog, chaturanga, and down dog. Inhale the left leg up, step it through. Warrior one. Straightening the lead knee, prepare for revolving triangle. Hip square, reaching with the right hand, lower down. Facing down, intense side stretch. And let's bring the hands over to the left, bending the left knee for side crow is a twist. And back into intense side stretch alignment for the feet, both hands on the floor to the left, breathe into your sides. Excellent, let's add a little interval here either if you're modifying things, just walk in a creative way. Otherwise, we're just going to take plank and twist the knees to one side with a little hop opposite side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. And plank. From here, take your left leg on the outside of the right hand and hold here back to plank opposite side bending the knee hold here step it again and again again and again and back to center plank Let's this time take the right foot, or sorry, the left foot to the front of the mat on the outside of the left hand. Lower your shoulder underneath the knee, walk the foot in and 
take a monkey side plank and just go hold it here. Great. Step it back. Opposite side. Hold it. Let's bring the shoulder underneath the knee. Walk the foot in. Monkey side plank. Excellent. We may come back to that in a little more advanced version in a second. Chaturanga, up dog. Chaturanga, down dog. Right leg comes up. Right foot to the front of the mat. Right hand on the inside of the right foot. Side angle, reaching over the head. Come slightly up, reach with both hands, keep opening the left rib cage. Up, excellent, step it back, plank, no vinyasa, left side, side angle. Reaching over the head. As I said, we'll be detoxing mostly. Everything is working on this area of digestive organs and come up. And step it back, right foot, side angle, maybe clasp under, and this time bring the shoulder under, monkey side plank, with, if you want to work on the whole version, Make sure that you are in fact warmed up. I'm in a really warm climate today. So I'm warmed up and open here and maybe move into an arm balance and be back up dog. And plank, guess what? <laughs> and side angle, left foot steps in, take your side angle. Clasp under. Opening that rib cage. All right. So here, just make it, make it as deep as you can here, the shoulder underneath the knee so you have a nice deep hold. Either hold here, you just work your way towards opening and maybe moving into an arm balance. And step it back, up dog. Chaturanga, down dog. Step the right foot between the hands, drop the back heel down. Warrior one, warrior two, revolving. Straightening the lead knee, triangle pose. Reaching over the head, maybe reach with both hands, working on, on the abdominals, lower down. Plank, chaturanga, up dog, down dog. Left foot steps in, warrior one, warrior two, revolving. Straightening the legs, triangle pose, opening that right hip, maybe using the abs, reaching over the head. And coming up here, plie. Side to side reaches. One, two, four, five, six. Keeping so try not to wiggle around here. Really have a nice clean move, controlling both sides. Great. Let's stretch the inner thighs. Coming out of 
like this. Walk the feet closer, knee slightly closer. Walk the hands to the front, down dog. Right leg comes up. Wow thing. Pigeon. Square the hips. Twist. Twist. Hold. back up here you just bring the left knee into the right foot and deepen that twist by walking your hands as far behind you as you can softening into the twist and back into down dog left leg comes up and well thing. Two pigeon. Twist and twist. And maybe Stay here. Coming up, bring your right knee into your left and twist. Great, from here we'll come into a seated. Hands behind you. Keep your heels on the ground, forehead to the floor, changing sides. Coming back up, lower down, right knee into the chest, twist. into the chest. You can rock side to side here. A 
Let's bring the knees behind, the hands behind the knees. Rock up to standing. Left knee on the ground, right foot on the outside of the left knee, reaching with the left hand to right. Left elbow to right knee, look behind you, maybe clasp here and hold for five breaths. stacking the knees on top of each other lower down inhale coming up right hand reaches forward left one above it wrap them up around each other and lift to open the back of the shoulders you can reach with your elbows up softening the back of the shoulder if you have tight shoulders I've had a few shoulder focusing shoulder opening classes in in my VIP section on my website changing sites that focus specifically on shoulders recently and right arm reaches up twist here maybe clasp under open lengthen to the crown of the head Open the chest, look over your left shoulder. Let's bring the left arm forward, right one above it, wrap them around each other and reach up. Soften the back of the shoulder. You can move here. You can straighten the elbows a little and see how that feels. Move with your body. Have this as an opportunity to learn about your body. Unwrap shape. Bring your legs in front of your favorite plow. If you're not doing plow, just feel free to do happy baby. Otherwise, wow. You can shimmy the shoulders here. Two shoulder stands. Coming out of this, to bridge, coming out of bridge into fish. Crown of the head on the ground, 
or towards the ground and just allow yourself to lay here for a few moments open the palms of the hands up let your feet drop to the side and make yourself maybe in three stages feel heavier so so drop into the ground feeling heavy and again take a big breath in and as you exhale get a little heavier you will feel that there is always a little more to go and once you reach a certain level get satisfied so stay there there's always more but it's also the magic is to also be happy with where you're at and just stay here enjoying the weight of your body the contact with the floor and the feeling of timelessness namaste Thank you.